Now, Michael Sheen, very exciting. Uh, since we last saw you on the show, uh, much excitement, hoopla, hurrah, uh, you've got your OBE from the Queen. I have. Thank you. About 12. Oh, it must, have been, it must have been amazing. Did she your family thought, go and everything? She thought she was giving it to Tony Blair. <laughs> <laughs> well, did, well, did she? Did that come up? Well, uh, she, did, she did say to me, because she... I mean, this is so extraordinary thing. We drove into Buckingham Palace. I went with my... Oh, there's uh, you with the other... With the, with the, the other queen, the fake queen, yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> we drove in there, and it was strangely like deja vu, because we'd recreated it for the film The Queen. So I sort of felt quite at home there. <laughs> yeah, I like them before, yeah. <laughs> and, then, uh, and then you get in front of the actual queen, and, uh, and there's all these rules that you have, you know, the etiquette and stuff. You have to go in, you must never turn your back on the queen and all this kind of stuff. So I turn up, uh, and, and she sort of... And she's got someone next to her going, this is Michael Sheen, he's a Herbert from Wales, he's an actor. <laughs> uh, he played Blair in that film about you. Um, <laughs> and, and you come up, and she comes forward, and she sort of shakes your hand, and... Uh, and then she, and then she sort of puts the medal on you, and then she said, um, she said, so what are you doing next? And uh, when I told my agent in America that, she went, oh, everyone's an agent. <laughs> uh, and I said, what are you doing next? And uh, and I thought, and uh, the truth was that I was about to do a film called Tron. Uh, but I thought that probably wouldn't go down well with the Queen. She might not get that. And I've only got a short amount of time to talk to her. So I said, uh, I'm doing another film about. Uh, Ex-Prime Minister Blair, and this one's about uh, his relationship with President Bill Clinton. And she got a little sort of sparkle in her eye, and she went, "Ooh, that must be awfully difficult." <laughs> uh, and then, uh, and then she shakes your hand again, and because she must meet so many people, obviously, and all the time, and. Presumably a lot of people get a bit rabbit in the headlights with her. Uh, so she does this thing where she shakes your hand and when it's time for you to go, she just kind of shoves you away. <laughs> 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 and I, I come from Port Albert, which is quite rough, and I was like, whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Backing off. <laughs> because there's been quite a lot of royal encounters on, on the couch. Because, uh, Kate, you met Prince Philip. No, I, well, I was invited round for lunch a, a, wh a while ago, and I couldn't quite work out why, and I thought it must have been the fact that I'd played her ancestor, yeah. the other Elizabeth. And um, I, I went and there was the head of the fire brigade and a neuro neurologist, this famous, world-famous neurologist, and I thought, well, what's the common denominator? And it is a very odd thing to be eating off crockery that says ER2. But anyway, so you get over that, and I sat next to him, and he said, and what do you do? And I said, well, I'm an actor. And he said, well, I was given a DVD player for Christmas and I can't work out, do I put the yellow... <laughs> <laughs> I, thought, I tried to be of some use. Because <laughs> you've met... You, I know you've met Prince Charles. <coughs> Is I he, did, yeah. Was that Moulin it Rouge? Was at a, it was at the Leicester Square premiere for Moulin Rouge, which I suppose was a royal... Oh, there he is. But I was standing next to Nicole Kidman and he came up, and I, bear in mind, I've been acting in Britain for some time at this point, maybe ten years or something, and, uh, and, I, and, and, it, and it's the premiere for the film <laughs> that I'm in with Nicole. And he said, what do you do in the film? <laughs> I think he thought I was the writer or something. I said, well, I play her boyfriend. And then he was gone. Oh, <laughs> 